da 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 Hello? Hello? If you can hear me, hopefully. Twitch hasn't cut me off again. This is a special video. This video is a milestone video. And as we load up Space Engineers, I want to thank everybody who has reached out and also everyone who has subscribed in the last year, but also in the last few weeks, last month, I've reached 1,000 subscribers. A thing I never thought would happen. So to say thank you, I'm bringing forward my showcase of the MA Admiral Suite. And I just want you to take a moment just to look at how gorgeous this looks in the teak design using hashtag 654321 as the colour. Thanks to Paul Thompson for that tip. My good friend who is rocking on this Jaeger build which will be ready fairly soon. We will then do another video and we'll explain how you'll be able to get this build. And as a subscriber of the channel, you'll be able to get this build. But we will keep you updated for definite on it. It is a staggering build. And if you follow any of the links on my channel down at the bottom to Paul Thompson, scroll down, find the Jaeger Progress builds. And uh, I, I cannot, I can't, uh, <laughs> I can't put it into words how fantastic that whole thing is. Admiral Suite. Released onto Mod.io. This functions slightly differently on Mod.io. I believe it has scripted lighting on the PC, but on Mod.io, unless you're on a dedicated server, uh, things like that kind of script don't work. But Auto McDonough has done an absolutely fantastic job on this. The detail is stunning. Things work. Shower opens and closes. And you've got several options. You've got open floor and ceiling, so you can build your own room around it. You've got enclosed, so you can use the Admiral Suites design. You have wall-mounted guns, an alien-looking spaceship, blank, and some cool different angles of said alien looking spaceship. You can create rooms like this one. And it looks absolutely fantastic. Got windows. You've got these ceiling pieces, half ceiling pieces that you can use the upper floor it's got different corridors different doors these doors are brilliant you can have some open doors as well i do believe some of it uses lcds but again i think they rely on scripts you have staircases you can give your build or your base a totally different look you can create vaulted ceilings. There are even walls with holes in, so you can put things like refineries and reactors behind them. Cargo containers. Just 
put this little showcase together to show you a few things. Plus, also, it works well with the interior passages mod. It has a flush air vent that I absolutely adore. That whole Star Trek kind of vibe to your builds as well. And there's a lot of options for you to utilize. A lot of open and a lot of enclosed blocks. And if we take a look, you can also make freestanding pillars. Pop along to the actual mod itself. Ignore the interior passages for a moment. It starts here. You get the wall. Wall 2. Enclosed walls. Enclosed wall 2. There's the wall access. You can have lights, which I've got in here if you look. Those don't require scripts. They do work. An enclosed blank space, a wall cover, which I think I have somewhere here. And then you have all of the corners and various designs which I've used. You have the bathroom and the shower. The author is, I think, still working on rooms. You have the various doors, the stairs, the air vents, which you can get enclosed as well, and the whole range of different ceiling blocks. So when you combine this with interior passages, like I have here, a lighted passage, Lighted intersections. And you can combine that with some of the stuff from the Admiral Suite. And you'll see that it works beautifully. Seamlessly with interior passages. So if you combine interior passages plus Admiral Suite, you could make some absolutely fantastic looking starships and some absolutely wonderful looking bases. That's really all I can say for this particular mod. It is Auto McDonough and superb design. Make some great rooms like this. Give your bases and ships a really unique look. That's it, really. Once again, I'd like to thank everyone who has subscribed to get me over a thousand subscribers. And there's more to come. In fact, tomorrow I'll be looking at Flare EK's tiered gyros which i was playing around with today and not long after that i'll probably be doing flares tiered ion thrusters i'll be making my way through the flare mods that's tomorrow and sunday probably some mod showcases for you as i move into more content creation next week there will be new player guides, there'll be tutorials, there'll probably be a DeWolfy one plays where I chat to you while I build part of a large grid ship, which, as you know, as I do these things, I do explain what I'm doing. So they kind of function like an informal tutorial. 
though mine tend to be informal tutorials anyway. Thanks again. Take care, stay safe, have fun, enjoy the game. There is a lot more coming to Space Engineers. I'm pretty much certain we shall hear something soon. And bye for now. <laughs>